How is it going guys? Welcome back to my Skyrim getting every skill to level 100 series. Let me just wait till the morning so we get some light on the scene. Yes, welcome back. I believe last video was one-handed, wasn't it? Man, that was quite the uh quite the journey, I will not deny. Um so I've decided, despite the fact that I'm kitted out in a set of full ebony, beautiful set of ebony, I have decided that for this video, I want to do light armor instead of heavy. Um, and the reason for this is because, um, I've kind of planned out like, the order of every video in this series already, and for some reason in my notes, I planned light armor in front of heavy, and instead of rewriting it, it's more convenient to just make a set of light armor, uh, from scratch. I apologize if I sound like I'm out of breath. I <laughs> just got done working out, and I am extremely out of breath. I could not wait, I could not wait to record. Today, I'm gonna be so productive, I just had to get a head start, you know? It's 6 a.m., 6.30 a.m., and oh boy, am I ready. But, uh, I'm gonna go to Kynes Grove. I'm already at Kynes Grove. I'm a bit ahead of myself. Kynes Grove, if you guys don't remember from my smithing video, is a Malachite farm. Malachite mine. So, we're gonna, we're gonna be using glass armor as, well, I'll show you. Glass armor is the best light armor aside from dragon scale. Um, and in order to get dragon scale, we're gonna have to activate dragons, and that opens a whole a can of worms that does not need to be open. I think I glitched out the, uh, I think maybe it's because I have telekinesis on. I think, uh-oh, I think the mine is bugged. That's really not good. Let me just quickly find one more ore. Is this one bugged? Yeah, it looks like the mine is bugged. I wonder if I can just swing at it, maybe? I'm not even connecting, I don't think. Shut up, Mercurio. Actually, we're probably gonna have to get rid of this guy because, like, part of leveling up light all about is getting smacked. A million times over and over again, so Mercurio is probably gonna be trying to defend me and that's gonna be counterproductive. But um, what are we gonna do about the Malachite issue? I only have 200 bucks. I was gonna say we can go buy some, but yeah, uh, clearly that is not the case. Um, fuck. <laughs> yeah, just fuck. Oh, you know, no, 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 you know what? I do know what we can do. We can go to North Watch Keep, which is like up here or something. It's a Thalamore camp or Thalamore base that you're sent to during the In My Time of Need quest. Oh, not In My Time of Need. I forget the name of the quest, but it's the one where you have to find Alvustein Greymain or it's Thorwald. I don't know which what it's one of them. And he's held at the Thalamore camp, but if you're high enough level, the Thalamore won't have elven armor, they have, they have glass. So I bet I could take a set of glass armor off of uh, one elf, and then I'll just um, in improve it with money. Alright, that sounds like a plan. It's gonna be quite the quite the ride. I'm gonna try to use my horsey, but uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in th on the flip side. Okay, so I'm very, very close. Let me just get rid of this marker. Now, I don't actually know if any of them are actually gonna have glass armor on. Let me just double check that I am on legendary. Okay, I am. Because that's part of the challenge. Right. Uh, okay. Let's see. I can see one. It looks like he has elven. Uh, I think this- yeah, okay. I see a few with glass. Okay. Let's just, uh, stay here, horsey. Don't- don't get any bright ideas. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna quickly grab ebony flesh. Uh, let's see. What else could I use? Paralysis rune. I may not need to use it. Is he gonna talk to me? What is this place? Move along. Uh, okay, I'll move along. Wink, wink. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, these guys have a bit of HP. Oh wow. These guys are actually quite tough. Uh oh. Okay, I just gotta pick one and stick to it. I'm gonna pick the lady. No sexism, just women have less of a right to live, you know? You know how it is. Is this the woman? Okay, yes it is. God, how weak is this fucking sword? 69 damage and I'm doing this little? That's crazy. Well, she's at least very close. Ow. Whoa. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, which one's mine? I think it's this one. Okay, she's dead. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. A right, glass armor, a helmet, boots, gauntlets. And I don't really need the mace. Horsey! Okay, we got a dip. Oh, they, they, oh wait, I thought I thought he was gonna give up, but nah, it doesn't look like he will. Unsurprised. Let's see, okay, I can fast travel. Um, let's just go to Whiterun. I probably should have took the mace to sell it, shouldn't I have? 
Oh well. So I'm gonna need. Um, I should also make a. I should make a shield, shouldn't I? Would that that would help? That'd be like a nice two for one. Um, alright. Well, uh, let's see. Glass shield. How much does that cost? I'm gonna need four malachites and one moonstone. I don't know. That sounds expensive. Let's I don't see. How much? How much does it cost? So f one malachite is. So okay, four malachite would be uh a thousand bucks plus the moonstone. Yeah, I I do not know if I have the funds for that uh jesus yeah all right why don't we go to like all of the different farms in skyrim see if our, any of the wheats grew back okay the wheats did grow back so what i think i might do just to earn a quick few bucks is i'm gonna go to each of these farms pick up as much wheat as i can then go cluster uh what's it called creep cluster farming and uh we'll just make a bunch of potions and hopefully that should raise at least a thousand bucks you know maybe a bit less maybe a bit more i mean how much is the wheat we have right now i don't i don't even know if i can find this much creep cluster easily i always think creep cluster is more common than it is but yeah 25 like that should be good let's go to kind's grove and just scan in the area for creep cluster i think okay so i found 24 i mean that that's close enough really that that's close enough uh, we don't need exactly 25 um <laughs> i'm getting a bit lazy what that dude thinks we're friends lol all right let's head down to arcadia's cauldron um what we can also do just to uh actually what am i even talking about i'm just yapping at this point while i'm thinking of it what do i have the warrior stone okay i do because we're gonna wait light armor i think is actually a thief skill i think we need a thief stone for light armor i think she has like one creep cluster yeah let's see if i can steal this i think she also has a, a giant toe does she maybe i'm lying i think i'm just lying all right let's see creep cluster and wheat apparently i haven't done much alchemy in this playthrough yet i guess i was saving it for the alchemy video that video might actually be quite fun all right let's see so each one of these okay yeah see it was, it was about a thousand a bit more than I, i'll i'll take it and yes i'm gonna do the hit reset exploit um it, it's either i do that or i wait 48 hours in between ah, it's literally like then. the same outcome um but one of them is technically an exploit one right, of them then. technically isn't <laughs> the whole point of the series is to not do exploits but i think this one yeah, is so such like so close to not reads. being an exploit that it may as well not even count you know what i mean so i'm gonna need one moonstone plus four malachite for the shield plus another two malachite to improve I everything i don't know if i can afford all of that let's see so if i have one then i I have four total right now, which is enough to refine everything. Plus, I would need another four. See, I don't have enough for the moonstone. And I think I would need one more anyways. Um, okay, well, I, I need two strips. I think it's... Let's just buy four. Okay, so I need about, like, 500 bucks. How the hell am I gonna get 500 bucks? I think I could I could do those Thieves Guild quests. Yeah, because I, I, I did that, like, way back in the uh, enchanting video. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, in the Thieves Guild, I did a whole video on this, but you can make, like, 13,000 bucks an hour. Hour, um infinitely with the thieves guild radiant quests Take so give me a burglary desirable I all right right and then we're gonna talk to delvin and we're gonna get a bedlam get... job just keep your eyes out all right so for the let's see we're going to house Battleborn in White Run and just 500 goods in White Run. Beautiful. I know where a lot of money is in the city of White Run that we can steal and then fence off to Tanelia. It's actually really convenient that they both ended up being in this one city. It's like uh, a two for one, eh? I actually really love doing these quests. They're so fucking fun, in my opinion. All right, this is House Battleborn. Oh, hey, Olfred. <laughs> Just gonna break into the back door of your house if that's okay, dude. I think they're okay with it. I might I might be friends with the clan battle. I guess we'll fucking find out in a second. Okay, it'll off. If I stuck up to him, is that he gonna do I want me to I leave? Yeah, I don't think he wants to kick me out anymore. Let's go. Stop looking at me, it'll off. That counts as 60 bucks. Long live the empire, dude. For real. Let's make sure I quick save. Just steal Whoa, that's a master lock. Are you kidding me? Okay, I guess we're not going into that room. Alright, I think the item I'm supposed to steal is yeah, it's in that room. But let's just let's just steal anything of value in this house, you know. Just make as much progress as I can. Money is money, you know? Okay. Peeling. Ooh, a poison. Who keeps a poison on the you know, right next to their bed? That's very dangerous. Alright, what when, when it comes to expensive stuff to steal, there's no better place than the companions. I showed this off in my recent um video 
where I discussed five secrets in the companions, and I basically showed off several, several hundred bucks worth of goods that you can get in the companions, and it's just in this room, or at least some of it is in this room. There's so much here that, you know, realistically, like that, 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 that. Alright, so that's that room. There is plenty of stuff in the basement as well that's good for stealing. Oh my god, they almost caught me take that. Oh my gosh. Cardlax's room. Could have a danger heart and a giant toe. <laughs> Let's see, what about in this room? Uh, potion of the night, poison, some solid bucks to be made. Robbing the companions, you know? Lots of poisons and potions they got. Oh yeah, look at all that silver. And then in this room there should be some good stuff. Yeah, I know there's a bow in that. But I also know there's a crap ton of potions. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, that's that's way more than enough. Like that that was a bit excessive. But that should give us one to, to two thousand bucks, hopefully. You know, one of these days in between videos, I'm just gonna find a way to make like twenty thousand bucks. Just so I don't have to worry about it every video. You know, I feel like this is such a common issue. Like just raising the funds is like half the fight, isn't it? Well, it's more like 75% of the fight. Most of the grinding is just mindless, tedious, um, spam clicking or, or something like that. Right. Delvin, I completed the job. It's gonna give me 500 bucks. Talk to Vex, she'll give me another 500. And now, if we quick save, talk to Tanelia. I already have a thousand, but if I just get rid of all of the crap that I stole, I should be up pretty big. I'll keep the healing potions, just cause like they actually have like some utility, you know? Mm. Alright, looks like we have 2,400. That is perfect, baby. Okay, so I need to buy, I think, I one more Malak shite and one Moonstone. She doesn't have any. Okay. Don't forget to check inside the shop. <sighs> Alright. Alright, let's just buy two, because I think it might actually be two. Either way, let's quickly open up glass, make myself the shield, and all I need to I do is improve. So it's definitely not going to be as protection heavy as my ebony stuff. I probably could have gotten like a blacksmith potion that increases it by like 20%, but at that point, like it's not super important because I do still have ebony flesh. But my armor rating is going to be 163 and it's going to go down to 136. Well, technically, it's going to go up because the shield, but that doesn't like really add, um, doesn't really add to it, you know. Let's just hotkey the shield to five. So I think I might have ebony flesh on my right hand, possibly even healing. I mean, I could double this up as like, I could triple this up as light armor or block and restoration training, could not. Um, do I, how do I look? Oh God, it's not that fancy looking. Oh, it's fancy looking, but it's pretty shite. Um, see, I could like get some uh, like restoration enchantments on this. I, I would need two grand sword gems. And I mean, I just went through the trouble of making all of this money. I'll, I'll give him one buck, which should increase my, my speech by a little a bit. Do I have, uh, yeah, I do. Maybe I should get a, a lure since Faringar is the opposite sex from me. And then I can also get haggling level two. Fuck it, I get level three. That should make my prices with any man in the game much higher. Maybe I'll be able to afford two grand sword gems on 1700. I actually, I significantly doubt it. We will see. I don't even know if I have the enchantment. I had you Let's see. Oh, wow, I might be able to. These are empty and they're that cheap. Let's see. Oh my God. So you're really not gonna give me? Okay, 900. Oh, I could barely not afford a second. Crap. Well, I could sell my, my worthless ones. Yeah, now I have plenty of money. Okay, nice. Move, Farangari. I'm only gonna be able to get it down uh, 50 percent because I don't because I'm only gonna use two right but I can also increase magicka so it's not as like bad you know uh restoration magicka and oh you can't put it on all of them or oh, maybe that's because it's just the magicka so I guess we'll put the second one on health because I will need more health all right that worked out perfectly I should also so probably buy your... um you know fast healing all right so fast healing will cost 32 not bad um once I get restoration to level 25 if i even do that i will be able to cut that cost in half as well but i'm using a lot of perk points that i haven't even like invested into light armor yet 
Crap. So, okay, I think I'm gonna need to do the all iteration um, leveling up thing just to get myself like 10 perk oh, points. That sounds good to me. Okay, yeah, yeah. So why, why don't why don't we quickly put my ebony stuff back on? We'll, we'll get 10, 10 extra perk points. So once I'm level 60, oh, sorry, 75, we'll stop. So it's legendary all iteration. What about telekinesis? And uh, find one item that I can grab. Let's grab the basket. Let's go to Markarth. If you guys don't know how this glitch or this exploit, it's not really a glitch, how this exploit works, um, the game basically thinks that we actually walked that entire distance with it active, which like gives us a crap ton of XP. So let's grab that leg of goat and uh, head to Riverwood. We're gonna go to Riverwood instead of White Run from now on, because I think White Run doesn't have any immediate items to grab like Riverwood does. So like in Riverwood, I can just quickly grab like one of those iron ingots or something. Just go to Markarth. Okay, so I actually got to level 78. I did it one more time than I planned, you know, just just to be safe. Okay, so I believe now it's actually like we're actually ready to begin the process. So. Glass shield is heart key to five. Ebony flesh is four. And I think I might make fast healing B3. Okay. Makes sense to me. So, we're first gonna test it out on a giant. Because the more damage that you block is the more XP that you get. Okay, that's a floating mammoth. So, if I, if I can withstand an, a legendary giant, then by all means, I should be doing this. But we may have to start out with something a bit less, uh... Fucky uppy, if that makes sense. Oh. Oof, I really don't know. Oh crap, and my fast healing is not as good as I thought it was. Run! <laughs> oh my god, I do not have as much magicka as I thought. Wow, okay, giants was not the strategy. And clearly, run horsey! Oh god, <laughs> run. He's right behind me, isn't he? Quick. Okay, yeah, no, no giants. Okay, I suspected that that, that that might happen. Okay, no, no issue. No issue. Fuck, and that was with like ebony flesh and everything. Damn. Um, yeah, that is quite unfortunate. I did get like a bit of... I did get quite a bit of block XP and a little bit of restoration too, damn. So instead we're gonna just do Horkers, I believe. I think this might be the, the strategy. I think I'm gonna be leveling up block a lot more than light all in there. I don't know if I want to do that necessarily, because then I'm just like, I'm kind of gonna not be doing much blocking in the blocking video. I wonder if I would get more XP by not blocking anyways. Like crap, this is looking like it's gonna take quite a while. Uh oh. Oh wait, I don't even have most of it equipped. That's why. Jesus, I'm so stupid. I had I still have my ebony stuff on. Okay, I am cornered though. Uh. Uh oh. What the hell? These guys are really dogging on me. Okay, I might have to quick load. They just these three horkers just beat the ever living fuck out of me. Okay, do I got the full sets on? Okay, I do. Let's grab some ebony flesh. Okay, and what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna kill one of them so that they don't corner me again like that. Okay, so it's just two. Make sure I have ebony flesh. And, uh, yeah. Let's just let him smack me. Let's see how quickly I can level up. I do have the warrior stone. I did say I was gonna get the thief stone, didn't I? Okay, well, let's, let's, let's just farm them until I can't take it anymore. Then I'll go back and get the thief stone. Okay, so I just got light armor to 20, which is good because I can now get an extra 20% more defense. But I believe I've actually been getting restoration a bit higher. So let's get dual casting, which will help me a lot. Regeneration will help me a lot. And I would also like to get, um, let's see, what's the one that I wanted to get? I wanted to get re recovery, but I also want to get apprentice restoration, which will make this cost half as much. So I think, you know, I've got to level a 20. I think it's time I get, I get the, the thief stone. Actually, let me look it up. Cause I don't, I don't even know if that's necessarily true. I'm pretty positive it is, but let me look it up. Okay. I looked it up. It, it, I am correct. It is a thief stone. So I was correct in uh, thinking that that would give me an extra 20%. Um, 
Um, and I guess I could get the well arrested too, couldn't I? So I think what we'd have to do it at, at solitude because obviously fast traveling around reduces the time you have with the well arrested bonus. So I think we'd have to do it at solitude if we even can. But this would give us an extra 10%. So let's get a Welcome room. To... And if we sleep for one hour, that should be Let good enough. So that should be a total of 30% uh, better leveling. I don't know if there's anything else I can really do. I could get the lover bonus if I got married married but i feel like that's a bit complicated just for an extra five percent um okay i'm back hello do i still have well arrested yeah for eight hours i don't know how much time i have left on it but uh-oh okay the thalmor want me uh-oh oh crap what was that Did it <laughs> they're fighting the horkers so i'm gonna take care of this magic guy crap this was not part of the plan Oh, I think they're killing all of my XP farms. Get paralyzed. I'll take all of their loot too. So I won't be so short on coin from now on. Hopefully. Come here, stop killing my animals. This is what I get for doing it so close to the keep that I just harassed. Hey, he's floating away. Oh my god, he's gonna drown. <laughs> Maybe I should have come here. Whoa, he's like floating. What the hell? I think I glitched him out. Okay, I fixed him. There you go. Good night, friend. Alright, where's my horkers at? Okay, here we go. I thought that was a bear for a second. Holy. Kind of freaks me out. Alright, well, um, no time like the present. Get to it, bud. Hopefully that second one comes and helps him. Okay, these guys are actually dogging on me pretty rough. But I did get restoration to level 25, so I will now get apprentice restoration, which will help me greatly. And I did get light armor to 25. Oh, I thought this was level 25. Uh, yeah, I guess not. Okay, so once I get to level 30, I will get that. Alright, hopefully they don't kill me. Jeez, man. I guess that's me leveled up. That actually it helps so much um because i was about to die i think once i get block where is it once i get blocked to level 30 i'm gonna stop just because they want to save it for the blocking video because one skill for every video right so i want to you know i won't mind getting like the level 30 right? that's pretty harmless but this this is the light armor video it also like restoration is getting a lot of xp too so i think i'm gonna relax a little bit on the restoration or at least i'm gonna try to at least to the best of my ability but um yeah, I guess I'm gonna get back to it and I'll see you guys when something notable happens. Okay, so I have been grinding for a little bit and I do have all the two, uh, sorry, yeah, restoration at level 30. So I'm gonna get this just so my magic regenerates a little bit faster. I'm actually at the point now where I'm not having many issues with magic regen. And I think I've decided I'm gonna use restoration as much as I want. And then when I do the restoration video, I'll simply reset it to 15. That way, you know, it like doesn't, you know, cross over. Anyways, I'm at uh, light armor 4. Now, so I'm gonna get another 20%. I did get this, so I think what was my armor rating to begin with? Like 130? Yeah, now it's 300, not even including the shield. Um, it's actually way better than my ebony stuff now, which is great. Um, and yeah, as you can see, they don't even do any damage to me. My magic and health regen combined is enough to kind of just let them do whatever they want to me, and I'm gonna be completely fine to do this so. I've just been doing this for a while. I think once I get to level 60, I'll be able to get this, which will help. This, which will also help. And I'll be able to get uh, level 4 of this. So once it gets to 60, maybe I'll try to fight some giants again. Um, we'll see how that goes. But for now, this method is working just fine. So yeah, I'll see you guys when there's another thing to update you on. Okay, so I do have light armor to level 60 now. We can get this perk. We can get unhindered, which doesn't really affect me that much. And windwalker, which will help me a little bit. Admittedly, not as much as I would like. Um, matching set is going to be great. And so will that. My armor my rating is now up to 360, so we're gonna go test out how I can put up with some giants. So, I know giants and horkers are two extremely different beasts. Oh my god, these horkers are really giving me a struggle. But yeah, I know they're com two completely different beasts. In fact, we might actually go to Secunda's Kiss, just because it's a bit more of a isolated fight. There's actually two, but I'm, I'm pretty certain we can kill this one and then have an isolated fight with the other one. So let's just, let's just paralyze him, take him to the grave, and then, uh oh, I think his buddy's already getting into the fight. 
Let's see if I can get him. Oh right, yeah, he's paralyzed. Let's quickly kill his friend. All right, we're gonna have to put him down one more time. All right, he's dead. Let's make sure I have ebony flesh. Let's get the shield out. <laughs> Cause I'm definitely gonna need the shield. Don't, let's not be arrogant. Okay, nice, nice one, buddy. Nice. But yeah, I can actually, like I can actually withstand several hits from him. I'm definitely gonna have to do some like runaway breaks where I quickly just run away to spam fast healing. But I can clearly take several hits. Especially when he does that, those ones. I almost don't feel like I'm getting as much bang for my buck though. Can he hit me from this? Whoa. Yeah, I guess I'll- yeah, like, let's have a look. It, okay, well, it seems like I'm getting a bit of XP relatively quickly. It's definitely- it's not as mindless, I would think. I have to actually, like, be very conscious of not letting him fucking kill me. I bet if I also, um, like, put a point into blocking, like, just- just that 20% would make my survivability much higher, I think, right? Well, let's see at least. Get my ebony flesh back. Yeah, I don't know about this. This isn't seeming to be... Whoa, calm down, buddy. This isn't proving to be insanely effective. So let's just paralyze him and run away. Yeah, I don't I don't like this strat. I think we're gonna go back to the tried and true. And I think we're gonna just do this, like the hawker method, um, for the rest of my leveling. I feel like that's just like, this, this really is just the most viable method. So um, yeah, let me just drop a save and I guess we'll get back to it. Alright, I should be very close to level 80. Like, literally any second now. Come on, there we go. Wow. Um, yeah, so now I can get this, which is now 100% better. And I can also get matching set, which I guess I could have gotten before, but I guess I wanted to wait till this moment. Um, Light Armor actually has surprising, surprisingly few perks. The only one left to get is, um, Deft's Movement, which is actually kind of OP, not even gonna lie. So, yeah. Um, the video is basically done. My armor rating is at a <laughs> an astonishing 625, which, if you don't know, is well above the armor cap. I believe the armor cap is within about 500. It's something like 500. So, I'm now- I, I now have the maximum damage resistance that you could possibly have in the game. Um, plus my healing, like, yeah. I guess I will see you guys when I'm done, because there's really not much more to do. Um, it is slowing down rapidly, which does suck. But I've just been watching like YouTube videos on my second monitor and it gets me through it. So yeah, I'll see you guys when we are done. And there we go. Light armor to 100. And I can finally get rid of these guys. I cannot tell you how tempting that little tiny HP, HP bar has been. I've wanted to kill that guy for so long. Level 100. That is every perk now unlocked. Light armor is now maxed out and wow. You know what? This did not take the longest. Surprisingly, that was like that was surprisingly fast. I'm um, one-handed. I think so far has been the slowest. Alteration was pretty slow. Um, but yeah, I think one-handed was way slower than light armor. This was very quick. Um, well, very quick in the grand scheme of uh, you know leveling up. Just for fun, my armor rating is. 659 with the shield it is 740 so yeah that is pretty sick isn't it next video i think we're gonna do block since we've already made a bit of progress with it and it's kind of in the same vein all the most as light armor so i mean i thank you guys so so much for watching the whole thing it really really means a ton to me um make sure you guys drop a like drop a sub and consider becoming a channel a member for 299 a month it's very cheap and it supports me greatly and it allows me to con continue to make these videos with the speed and the precision as I always do. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Stay awesome and peace out.